Tonight, it remains to be seen if a Catholic school in Fort Lauderdale will be able to reopen before the school year ends. Vandals trashed it over the weekend, and no one knows who those vandals are or why they would want to do so much damage. My laptop is totally gone. Instead of teaching, Tracy Powell spent Tuesday cleaning up after vandals went on a wrecking ball spree over the long holiday weekend. I was literally stepping over stuff, you know, trying to be careful because it was glass everywhere. All 10 classrooms at the Showers of Blessing Private Christian School have damage. Smashed windows, punched walls, broken toilets, overturned shelves, books and desks strewn everywhere. Very heartbreaking, like it's nothing that we would have imagined or even thought of. You know, you hear break-ins and vandalism, but to this extent, it was just total shock. Students weren't able to attend class Tuesday, and it's not clear if they'll be able to finish the school year. Youth Pastor Tyson Brooks spent the day picking up pieces of porcelain and glass, struggling to understand who would do this and why. It hurts our heart to see this magnitude. I, I can't begin to point my finger on what would trigger this, you know, um, but it's, it's sad to say, but it, it may have been from someone in our own community. Surveillance video from a church camera pointed in the direction of the school shows someone on a bike riding to the back on Sunday at about 6 p.m. And if you look in the corner of the screen, you can see a handful of what appears to be kids around the building. Later, someone can be seen walking away. We're hoping to find whomever it is, you know, if they need help. We're, that's what we're here in the community to do, is to help. And this is what, you know, our goal and our vision is at the school. Again, police do not have any suspects or any real leads to go on tonight. If you think you can help detectives, you're urged to call Broward Crime Stoppers.